We'll have to get back to you on that once we get to stage two. Here is Matthew Day. He made it to stage three last year. Made it to stage two way back in 2017, actually. So he is an incredibly strong athlete, incredibly powerful. The head coach at Power Sports in Texas. Which you, I believe you can see represented on his shirt. He is moving too fast to tell. I didn't recognize him at all today because of the beard he's got going on. Well, he's got 50 seconds, loads of time. Just a little bit behind Caleb Bergstrom's pace to this point. And you can hear Jonathan Bange and Karsten on the sidelines, two other Texas Ninjas cheering him on, telling him how much time he has left to go. And right now we have 30 seconds. If we can get quickly through here, I'll feel confident and about- And that's a great pullback on the ring. He can go on this swing and he, uh-oh, thinks better of it. Mm, okay, he makes clear. it, 20 seconds. There's plenty of time. He beat Wingdings last year in the World Championship. That means he can probably beat Splat a lot, but a little bit more time pressure here. And you saw him kind of looking around, trying to figure out where he was in the air. Down to oh, seven. No. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. Just did not have enough enough height to, to give his hands times to lock in. The placement was good. Um, he probably felt really confident with that throw, and it, it looked good, just didn't have enough time to lock it in right there. Ah, so, and he would have cleared too, so close. 